Okay, hello. I, of course, am expecting you all to speak brilliant English. Umberto Eco, who you probably know, famous Italian guru, suggested that translation was a betrayal that there is no such thing as translation, so there can only be negotiation. So here we go, here comes some negotiation. Я надеюсь и полагаю, что все замечательно знаете английский язык. Для тех, кто, может быть, не так замечательно знает язык, есть некий господин в моем лице, который поможет вам в понимании того, что я вам скажу. Как известный знаменитый Умберто Эко как-то сказал, что перевода как такового не существует. Есть не переводы, есть переговоры, есть торговля. И вот сейчас такой торговлей мы с вами и займемся. И безусловно, вы понимаете, что моя, в смысле, моя задача здесь гораздо сложнее, чем его, в смысле, его задача. Because, because after all, I think you've allowed me to talk about myself, and nothing could be easier. И вот те 115 лет приблизительно, которые мы имеем с момента зарождения кино в 1895 году до того времени, я считаю, это был всего лишь пролог. But that's not good enough just to have a prologue. Just think of all those millions and millions and millions of films that have been made in 113 years. But have they really been cinema? I would argue with you they have not. You film historians would certainly know the name Bazin, and way back in Paris in the 1920s, he suggested that cinema was a combination of the theater, literature, and painting. Uh, я думаю, что к знатоке кино знают такую фамилию, как Базан, который в 1925 году утверждал, что кино – это комбинация театра, uh, литературы и, uh, да, и живописи. I don't think much has changed. I still think cinema we practice, and maybe even especially the cinema that you now begin to practice all over again after wasted opportunities in Russia still is a moribund mixture of the theater, literature and maybe, maybe, but I doubt it, just a little painting. И до сих пор это замечание справедливо, и даже у вас в России, поскольку вы с момента 89 года имели массу возможностей все изменить, но все равно ничего не изменили, остается таким же, такой же комбинацией Театра, литературы и, может быть, совсем немного живописи. All of which leads you, obviously, to believe that I don't think, indeed, we have seen any cinema yet. But I believe it's about time we should and we could and we ought to be seeing it. If we take the notion of the digital revolution beginning at the same time that the Zappa was introduced into the living rooms of the Western world that we've had since 1983 to get this right. Но я думаю, настало давно пора, и вот это время настало действительно увидеть 
the opportunities there about what we have seen uh, essentially with a text-based cinema and not an image-based cinema should surely now be over. You know, I suspect, and I certainly know, what the manufacture of the moving picture is now capable of. And I'm hoping when our technicians here get it together for fuck's sake, that I'll be able to show you some of those amazing phenomena. For nearly 8,000 years, if you think that sensible, communicable civilization has been going for 8,000 years, the people who have organized your life and my life have been the text masters, the people who could manipulate text. Если вы возьмете историю человечества за последние 8000 лет и вообще подумайте, что люди, которые управляют моей жизнью и вашей, это люди, которые манипулируют текстом. They have been the gatekeepers, the orators, the speakers, the makers of holy books, the people who created our strategies and our systems of communication, all based on text. But there is, as I suggest, a sea change now. There is a way that the text masters are having to move aside for the image masters to take their place and to really begin to understand what the whole communication about imagery is really all about. But maybe the sad thing is, are you all ready for this? I believe, and of course I make an exception to all those people who are painters, that most of you are visually illiterate. What do you know about images if you've not been trained to use them or to perceive them? Just because you've got eyes doesn't mean to say that you can see. I'm getting signals here that they can't show my fucking pictures. So much for technology in Russia, shame on you.